Hi class, um, please excuse my scarf, but um, I just wanted to come to you today to share with you um, my journey and finding my primary source and in addition um, just some general information about my primary source. Um, so to begin, I had no idea what I was looking for, what I was doing, how was I going to do it or anything um, so I decided to go to the library I went on a hunt and I tried to get in touch with the um, history librarian but unfortunately his wife has been really really sick and it's kind of hard to get in touch with him um, so I just spoke to a few librarians and they advised me to go to the special collections department um, or even the California um, department in the library so um, on the day that I went, the California department was closed, so I was not able to get into there. Um, and I really wanted to do something on California because it's extra credit, right? So um, I went to the special collections department. I didn't feel like they were very helpful. I actually didn't feel like they knew what they were doing at all. Um... And it just really wasn't a good experience. But when I was speaking to the girl, there was someone else that is, it's a part of special collections, but it's actually their own department. And she was like, oh, well, because she was basically eavesdropping on the specific details that I was giving to the people in the special collections department. And she was like, oh, there's this great um, excerpt that came from a magazine, but it's actually published on its own. And I think this would be great for your assignment. So it was actually a little past the date that we were able to use. But I ran it past Laura Guardino and she approved it. And this ended up, and it's about 14 pages long. It's an article that Mary Halleck Foote wrote for Scribner's Magazine back in the, 18, in the late 1800s about her experience here in California on a mining camp. So, um, so I thought that was an amazing source. Unfortunately, I can't take it from the library. So I had to, um, make, I took photos of the actual document. And in addition to that, Mary Halleck Foote wrote a book. And the book is called Victorian Gentlewoman in the Far East. This book didn't actually, couldn't really help me in my primary analysis, but it gave me some general information about Mary Halleck Foote and just her experience and where she's from and how she got to the West Coast and things of that nature. So it actually, it, it's a primary source, but it was, it was actually just a really great foundation for me to really understand, um, the article that she wrote in the magazine that I'm analyzing for my primary source. So that's me coming at you today, giving you some general information on how I found my source and different things of that nature. So I hope you all are having a wonderful journey in finding your source, if not um, writing about your source and telling about your source and all that wonderful, great stuff. Have a wonderful, great weekend and happy Easter.